on the east side, Wilmington. We in Wilmington, we moss. Little youngster right here might get at somebody from the other side, and then later on you gonna hear about it like, oh, this was uh, it's, it's the east versus the west, just like that. Let's do what we gotta do. <laughs> this one, this one hard. Oh, Charlotte's Web yeah. on PCH. Don't try to leak it, cause they gonna leak you. Yeah. Come to the east side, yeah. on that hood every day. T Honey East L Street. We on the one five block. Free the frog. That's all I'ma say. Free the frog. Couple older niggas hate on me. Couple young niggas hate. It is what it is though, you know what I'm saying? My hood, Eastside Weemaw has been here since four Sureños and Norteños. My hood, we're Red Raggy Sureños. Sureños, we still run with the 13. You know? It's different, a lot of people look at us different. Like, we gonna kick the door down regardless. Like, we ain't backing off on this rap shit. Like, I tell you what, my ops, they not even haters to me no more. They more like fans. Like, I swear to God, they tuning in on everything. All this hating shit. I don't give a fuck about that shit, straight up. Cause everybody got their own opinion. As soon as you get into middle school, you got to go. Pick your little side and kick it who you really? gonna kick it with cause yeah, it's not just your ass. Your side as in like east to west or yeah, just like okay. you can't be kicking it with, with us and then go over there and be like, oh I'm friends with, I'm homies with these fools too. Yeah, it's clear division. Yeah, like, that's it. They won't get along with no bloods, so it's kinda like I see gang in it, they always harass me, they always search me, every time do, do their thing and I get I get busy after that. They leave me alone. Gang units Cops are a gang, straight up. And every hood is against the cops too, cause ain't nobody wanna go to jail, you know? Valley Club, the cult. Okay, babe, how the f did I end up in one of the most treacherous sections of the harbor area of Los Angeles, aka home of the infamous red rag wearing Sureños, aka East Wilmington, California, with the up and coming grimy gang member Mr. Babyface himself, you ask? Well, kick back and I'll tell you. A few weeks back, when I was interviewing grimy gang founder and one of LA's most hated Latino rappers, Swifty Blue, he was telling the story of how he was forced to start his own label when he parted ways with Mr. Chris in the crime family. Over the last few years, he has been quietly but consistently recruiting rappers to help push the grimy gang takeover agenda. One of these artists being Mr. Babyface, a street ass, thugged out ass, red rag banging Sureño from East Wilmington. If you've never heard of Wilmington, real quick, according to Wikipedia, it's a predominantly working class Hispanic community consisting of approximately 56,000 people, and of those 56,000, 86% are Hispanic. And according to Mr. Babyface, it's divided right smack dab down the middle between the blue side on the west of Avalon and the red side on the east of Avalon. And according to Mr. Babyface, color still matters around here, so just know that in case you're ever there. And with Mr. Babyface being the face of Wilmington music, it's only right we checked in with the man himself on our last visit to LA and let him show us around. So come with me, the biggest cactus of all time, aka Cork Capital, as we take a ride through the wild east side of Wilmington, California, home of the Red Rag Serenios. Hell yeah. We can start right here. I'm posted right here. Let's do it. Hell yeah, man. We on the east side. We on the east side of Wilmington. We on the east side of Wilmington. We in Wilmington. We moss. Feel me? Okay, we got. Uh, face of the dove right here. Mr. Babyface. Hell yeah, hell yeah. We on the east side. We have the little hood park. What little park is this? Uh, sh right here. This we right now we in Ghost Town. You know, uh, right now we in Ghost Town and shit. Uh, so this right here, this GT Park. It won't really come right here too much and shit, but I mean it's a little low low key area right now, you know what I'm saying? The other other little park be a little burnt out sometimes, so okay. we just gonna get in where we fit in type shit. It's the hood we comfortable wherever we go, you know what I'm saying? That's the hood, okay. Hell okay. yeah. This is Wilmington, so where is Wilmington in LA? Is this like South Central or are we on the west nah, side? Nah, this side? is okay, so like so like people be like, where you from? Like I'm not gonna tell them I'm from LA. Right. Like I am from the HA, so I'm from the harbor area. Okay. So the harbor area is like more like what would you say like like South Bay type? Okay. So it's the the harbor area. We got Wilmington, we got a uh, Harbor City, uh, we got uh, Pedro. Who else? We got uh, Long Beach, like all the little cities around us. So, we so you're part of that. Yeah. So I, yeah. So like other, other people say like, oh, I'm from LA too. Like people are gonna be like, oh no, I'm from South Central. Like nah, that's that's not us over here too. I'm from I'm from the harbor area, you know. Okay. I'm so I'm so I'm so different. Okay. So that's why that's why I, I look you got like my own motion over here cuz ain't nobody do ain't nobody putting on like the way I put on in the HA, you know, so That's why I just area, Hell like yeah, that. hell yeah. Fifth grade came and that's when I just started jumping out the porch I guess you would say, you know, okay. like sixth grade I was already kicking it with the homies like seventh grade I was already at seventh grade. I was already living on my own like I wanted to be on my own and and, seventh and, grade. and the homie tats the homie had took me in like oh, yeah, let's uh he like you can stay on my pad, but 
You just gotta go to school. I didn't really go to school. I just try to work and then one, mid, middle of seventh grade, I stopped going to school and they're hitting the juvenile hall. Boom, from there it was just in and out, in and out the hall. What school did you go to before you quit? Uh, I went to, I went to, uh, there's a school called Wilmington Middle. On the, yeah, it's on the other side and shit. So yeah, I went, I went right there probably for like a little bit. And then I end up, I end up, uh, uh, they tried to send me to, to the little, what would you call it? Little home study school. Okay. Yeah, cause we was just trying to turn up at the school and, shit, and okay. they, they try to they try to tell me like you can't come out here no more. So once they sent me to the other one, I just stopped going to school. So uh, the bloods used to be right here for sure and shit, little back streets or whatever. You know what I'm saying? Trying to do their little doggy. But also this is the hood, so we got a click from the hood that be over here as well. You know what I'm saying? Okay. So it's just a little different. Like, but I mean nowadays you won't see none of them. They they go hide down Long Beach or something. So nowadays yeah. it's cool. Yeah, hell yeah. Sick, I was just more, just more so chilling. Is, is Wilmington in general uh, like a Hispanic area? Yeah, like, yeah, of course. Yeah, there? yeah. Well, you're gonna see a lot of uh, Hispanics around everywhere in Wilmington and shit. That's why it's like, it's, 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 it's hard to put it like this, but, but I'm gonna just put it straight up. Like, okay, we go at it with the other side, but a little youngster right here might get at somebody from the other side, and then later on you gonna hear about it like, oh, this was a. Uh, it was with the Woo's cousin, like, you know what I'm saying? A lot of everybody's family, but it's just, we just, you know, it's it, the East versus the West, just like that. Oh, okay. We, we go out of here. Yeah. Okay. yeah, we go out of with each other. And you said that road, Avalon, is what separates yeah, us? Yeah, Avalon is, is, is more like uh, what separates us from, Jeez. you know what I'm saying? Yeah, hell yeah. yeah. Oh, so so we, from, we from Avalon all the way to, like, we from Avalon all the way to, uh, what would you say? In, uh, Alameda type? Yeah, huh? Cause then after that, yeah, it's, it's Long Beach. Yeah, yeah, hell yeah. After that, it's already Long Beach and shit. So, buy me shit. I mean, it's 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 big, but it's small. You know what I'm saying? So, it's shit. It's enough for us to run around and do what we gotta do. <laughs> <laughs> this one hard. We could try to hit the weed shop right quick. Let's go to the weed shop. We'll go to the shop right quick. This is Ghost Town Park. So we're leaving Ghost Town Park. Yeah, we're to the weed shop. Yeah, we're going to the little weed shop down the street. Come on, let's go. Let's hit it. Let's go to the weed shop. I'm in the hood every day. Booming, that be booming. Go get you a little twenty dollars. Get you a little seven grand. This <laughs> you right. That's a Cali love, huh? Hell yeah. Cali love different. Hey, you start coming here every day. They might trying to give you ten grand for the strength. Like what? Right. Off the strength, right? Exactly. Off the front. Off the good credit. Yeah. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. <laughs> you see how we go in there and like what? Our shortest way yeah. on PCH yeah. and Watson. So if you ever need something, hey, just. Don't try to leak it, cause they gonna leak you. You hear me? <laughs> you vlogging it? Yes, sir. All right, we right here at LNS. Feel me? Can you get some blunts right here. Get you a little dollar soda, whatever you need. Go right here. They are gonna get you right. Thank you. The ones in the middle. Thank you. Come on, let's go, brother. We come here every day, like three, four times a day. We right here. Oh, that video footage in the park. Oh, the park. See, this is the other park. I hear Greenbelt and shit. Shit burnt out though. <laughs> East L Street. We on the one five block. You know what I'm saying? We on L Street. We on L Street for surely. Look, this this right here, this brand new. Like three months ago, they didn't put all these. Oh, man, trainers and shit in here. 
we're not really with this. They probably got police in that motherfucker. But hell yeah, this is my block right here. I, where I hear the only two story. Hey, look, I'm putting it to you like this. The only two story on the house, I mean on the block, is this house right here. And that's where I was raised from. Feel me? All the way until I bounced out and started and started walking from the street. I walked through the alley and started, you know what I'm saying? That goes to show you like I, I wasn't trying to have my grandma and everybody see me the way I was trying to leave the house and everything. I take off through the alley. Go go straight down to the park. Watch, we finna hit this little alley right here. Yeah, like like where we're in 2023 mm -hmm. so i linked up with 50 like in 2022 he he hit me up like yo hard you know you got motion you doing your thing like let's run something so linked up with him and and from there we just took off i went all full grimy and, and we just we just put it into fake you know what i'm saying now grimy. hell yeah now we got grimies out on all platforms you know go stream every song right. let me know which one your favorite Hard, These niggas not even here, huh? What's it like working with Cheeto? Like, that shit was hard with you, Cheeto, and motherfucker. Man. Swifty, that shit was tough. Free the Frog. That's all I'm going to say. Free the Frog. When he get out, we do got an EP coming. Seven tracks. Me and Cheeto, back to back. We about to drop that shit. Like, man, working with Cheeto is like, man, that's it. Crazy? That's crazy because huh. he really... He really kicked the door down and, and going mainstream, you know what I'm saying? So I, I get to experience all of that as just being part of the squad and, and you know, right. just Grammy Mala on the set. Bring my brother Tito. We're gonna be back. He's gonna be back and we're gonna be back working soon. You know what I'm saying? Everything just everything just part of God's little motion. The way he wanna do it, that's where we're gonna go with it. There you go. Yeah. Oh, yeah. He dumped it, boy. That's what Yeah, look, we had a brand new little grill right here. Oh, I see. We had a brand new little grill. What's, what's the what's the what's the best part of being raised in Wilmington? What was the best part? Man, to child? me, like real family me, vibes, or was it like? Man, it was just more like raising Wilmington. To me, was just like all my homies, all my homies is they're not my homie. You know what I'm saying? They, they family like so like my circle is real small. I choose who I want to kick with. You know what I'm saying? Because right. I'm gonna just put it to you like this. There's a lot. There's a lot of homies from the hood, but they're not all my homies. Yeah. They're just homies from the hood. Right. You get what I'm saying? Good. Like. Couple older niggas hate on me. Couple young niggas hate. It is what it is, though. You know what I'm saying? That just happens when you really got motion and you really doing something. But it's a it's a small circle. I keep my circle real small. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, we good. I keep my circle real small and shit. So I don't really, I don't really talk to a lot of people. You know what I'm saying? And video where it was like hella blue rags, hella red rags. What was that? Oh yeah. So okay, yeah, exactly. When I did that one, that's up on the block. That's like one of my biggest hits right yeah. there. I linked up with I linked up with a uh, uh, demon from 16 Letter Boys all the way out in Pixley. Okay, that's all. And then shit, thing. yeah, he from Pixley. He 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 from far. I don't even know where that's at. Okay. So like he they he came. Up here. Yeah, they they drove to LA. Cars deep. What's up, buddy? What's what up, four? Chino. Yeah. Four, buddy. Yeah. So they 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 drove all the way out from they drove all the way up from wherever the f Pixley's at, you know? Okay. And they came to us. And it was just we just put the idea like. Yeah, we all my homies coming red and all your homies coming blue. They're gonna be like, what's really going on? You know what I'm saying? Right. But a lot of people. That's why that video. Yeah, like crazy, huh? a lot and a You're lot a good of people. Marketer. Exactly. So I'll be telling uh, fuck Swifty. I'm like, hey, yeah. you guys are all good marketers. And, and, shit. And, you know what I'm saying? And a lot of people don't know. A lot of people don't know, but my hood, my hood, Eastside. We must been here since. We've been here since before Sureños and Norteños. Okay. So the thing is, my hood, we're Red Rags Sureños. Okay. We wear the Red Rags, but we're not no Norteños. We Sureños, we still run with the 13, you know what I'm saying? Like, so it's different. A lot of people look at it as different. Like, when I got when I joined Grimey, when I when I, when I when I got part of the camp, everybody's like, why should you running around with somebody who's wearing the Red Rag? You know what I'm saying? So people are starting to tune in like, who's this, who's this, you know? And like I told you shit, I don't really wear blue like that, but ain't nobody safe around here, you know what I'm saying? So <laughs> we we smooth over oh, here, we smooth, we chilling. Oh god. You know what I'm saying? Sick. It's black and shit. Okay, that's tight. So your hood, like you said, is Serenios, but we're, you guys bang the red because Yeah, hell yeah. We, we we wear the red rag and shit. Just just that's that, that's just the way it been. You know, we've been wearing the red rag since since you know what I'm saying? Since I was way since back, like I said, time. since since before, before you Norteños and Sureños, exactly, since probably before my mother daddy met my mama.
That's typically a thing. The Nortenos were red, the Serenos were blue, right? Yep, but exactly. Got, but oh, okay, over here though, over here. Yeah, but over here, the east side, the east side of Wilmington, we were red. And then the other side, they were blue. So you couldn't wear blue because you're not. Yeah, well, out. I mean, like, it's not necessarily like you can't wear blue, you know what I'm saying? But that's that's not the color we rock, you know what I'm saying? Right. But shit. Facts. Hell yeah, man. Facts. That's just the way shit go over that's, here. That's... Growing up right here was just a little bit different, you know what I'm saying? Like, like I said, by the time, so like my mama and my daddy, they, 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 they divorced type. So once they divorced, that's when, that's when I just, they good, they good. It's good? Yeah, that's when I just went on my own. I just started, you know what I'm saying? Doing my own little thing. And by the time I was 12 years old, I was already running my own little muscle. so. You got a crazy little work ethic too, like as far as your drop rate with music and shit like that. Oh, videos bro. constantly, at least two or three videos a month. I've been noticing and shit. Like, you stay mad busy. How I just stay, try to. How you say so productive out here and shit? Like, yeah, like, exactly. How, like, how you be doing it, man. What's your secret? I put it to you just like this. When it's burnt out in the hood, and I ain't trying to be in the hood. Shit, we at the studio trying to trying to do something. You know what I'm saying? Try to keep ourselves like productive. I try to keep myself productive. Like, and my homies don't rap. None of my homies rap. None of that, but. I take my niggas with me too, like, come on, let's go see what a different life, different life is looking like, you know what I'm saying? Different shit, like, shit, I know I don't got it like that, but, I mean, we're gonna, we're gonna make, we're gonna make it look good, and we're gonna make it, we're gonna get there, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> like, regardless, we're gonna kick the door down regardless, like, shit. all I know is that, all I know is that, shit, we ain't backing off on this rap shit. like, I might not, like, like, I, I tell a lot of people now, like, shit, like you said too, I drop a lot of videos, but, shit, me, my videos don't satisfy me like that. I'm like, I'm not really hitting numbers or it's like, damn, like, I just, I'm about to drop another video, but this, this one hasn't even hit that good numbers, but it's really like, nothing can stop the motion. We just gonna keep it going, you know what I'm saying? We just gonna keep it going. The video gonna get old regardless. We just gonna keep dropping new shit, dropping new, and it's like, how do, so how, man. How do you deal with Swifty having so much opposition in the industry? You feel what I'm saying? Like, well, that you shit, being one of his artists, you gotta catch a lot of that crossfire and shit. You know what I'm saying? Man, that like, shit, that shit, there is it's even way different because it, 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 it's just there's more to it you know what i'm saying there's there's more to just everybody hates 50 it's just you know what i'm saying just, that's just, just how it go but i mean that's why do you think he gets so much hate shit it's just 50 being 50 you know what i'm saying whatever he do to yeah stay on this side or something whatever he do whatever he do to get his music motion that's what he doing a lot of people, a lot of people hate, a lot of people hate on Swifty, but he just turned it around and try to make it good for himself. You know what I'm saying? Like right. everybody gonna hate regardless. Just but be to yeah, this yeah, exactly. And that shit, like shit, me, me being from grimy and and, and, and and the way a lot of people be hating on Swifty and shit, I just gotta, I just gotta use it as like lately, lately I've been. Cause I've even been, in the smoke shop just now, dude was congratulating. Hell yeah, I seen you with Swifty, so and I noticed that too. Like a lot of my shit. And I'd be running into people, they'd be like, hell yeah, I seen you with Swifty. So it'd just be like a lot of internet. Yeah, but well, that's it, exactly. You know, it'd be cool. Exactly, exactly. Yeah. And a lot of people hate, but then when you run into them in person, they like, oh, what's up, bro? I see you doing this, doing that. It's just, it's just, it's just, people hate to see another man face all the time. Right. But then when when they see you, like, like, look at us right now, we doing, we doing, we doing what they watching, but we just doing it behind the scenes. This is what, how we barely doing it, and they're like, damn, that's tight. That shit. A lot of people wish they could do this shit, but they can't. You know what I'm saying? It's just this is just what come with it. Like what come with this rap. A lot of hate. Like I tell you what, my ops, they they not even haters to me no more. They more like fans. Like I swear to God, they tuning in on everything. I, I could go Instagram live right now. They're gonna be like the first ones to join. Like, come on, bro. Like, oh my God. you know what I'm saying? So, it's just, so they're the first ones to watch all the videos, exactly, all the vlogs, man, listen they, to all the music. They watching, yeah, exactly. They watching all my music videos, trying to see what I'm talking about, this and this, like all that. Shit, just you know what I'm saying? Like, come on now, that. But shit, that just gonna, that just gonna look. They gonna, they like this. They on their phone. Man, look at this nigga baby face. Ooh, ooh. talking around they though. So now they. Like, who this nigga? They finna go to him like, <laughs> come on, now, man. That's like, how it works. they just, oh, they, 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 they talking shit to all their homies. Look at this nigga, look. But they all watching me now. So now all his little homies are about to go on my page and go. They just, 
you just helping me get paid more, man. You know what I mean? Period. Like, it, this this would just come with this shit, but that's what you gotta understand. Like, all this hating shit, I don't give a fuck about that shit, straight up. Because everybody got their own opinion. Shit. I got my own opinion too, like, straight up. Like, like I said, a lot of people don't approve of me doing this shit. I'm gonna still do it anyway, straight up. Still rock. You know what I'm saying? You are pretty much the face of the East, I would say, right? In terms of music goes, is this another? Oh, yeah. Who else is doing music over here on the Shit. I, to me, I say like I'm the face of the whole dub, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. I, I, I got motion in the whole city regardless if people hate me or not. Right. The baby face. Hell yeah, man. The face I, of the dub. It's like 50 years for family. Exactly like. All right. All right. You, you That's what I've been trying to. Are you going to be the first putting on women's in or like who? Oh yeah, who for sure. You? Uh, not really nobody like that, to be honest. A lot of people I know just, I don't know shit. I don't, I don't really know nobody from Wilmington that really do it like this. That's why, that's why when I go places and shit, like, shit, I be at the gas station a lot too. Like, I go to the gas stations, like, you know what I'm saying? I'm driving around, I'm putting gas, whatever, in the city. A lot of people like, oh, you baby face, huh? You the one that's doing the video. Yeah, that's me. Like, but people like to see that because I'm the only young nigga that's doing music videos and all that for the city, you know what I'm saying? Right. Or at, at least out the city. Right. They probably might not f what I'm saying or what, but. At least they see somebody's doing something for the city, you know what I'm saying? I, I, just be, I just be doing my little thug I put on for whatever best way I could put on. You know what I'm saying? Like if I could if I could rap, if I could rap and tell my story life on, on, on how how I became like this, then sh and I could get paid off it, and that's what I'ma do, you know what I'm saying? And, and sh that's what I just been running with. And, and, you know what I'm saying? Since day one. That's good. Hey, none of you fools got a lighter? What was Wilmington like coming up for you, man? Everything was crazy. Everything crazy, right? As soon as you get into middle school, you got to go pick your little side and kick it who you really? gonna kick it with. Cause it's not just your ass. Your side as in like east or west or yeah, just, like okay. you can't be kicking it with, with us and then go over there and be like, oh, I'm friends, with, I'm homies with these fools too. Yeah, it's and clear shit. division. Yeah, like, that's it. Divided up. Yeah. Okay, that's crazy. What are some of the uh, what are some of the good things about coming up in Wilmington? He said it's like. You guys are like brothers. Yeah, it's like, we got, it's like family building right here. Family. Like shit. You guys came from like <clears throat> playing with toys together and shit. Are your um, parents and grandparents from Mexico? Or? Yeah, yeah. Everyone. Parents Mexico. most likely came from Mexico really? and settled down right here. Your parents too? Yeah, my dad too. What side did they come uh, from? My, my dad's from well, Juarez, Mexico, and then Water? my mom's Guatemala. Oh, yeah. Guatemala. Yeah. Okay. They linked out here or they linked Yeah, they out met over here. Oh. And then that's when I, I was born in. Is there like any, uh, like, between, Wilmington's a predominantly Hispanic area. Yeah, for sure. Is there like, I know Long Beach is real Asian, there's other little real black areas. Do you yeah. see a lot of racial tension nowadays, or is that shit kind of like a Sometimes thing Sometimes it depends where, what hood you're from, because some hoods don't like Mexicans, and some hoods don't yeah, like exactly. black, you know, so it's all just mixed up. Just kind of depends? Yeah, it just depends on where they're from. Where you're at, where yeah. you're fucking with yeah. and shit. That's crazy. All right. Yeah. What about you, bro? Do you, do you notice a lot of racial tension between like different races, like Asians and Blacks? Racial and tension, and stuff? shit. Man, or is that shit kind of thing in the past? Bro? Over here, over here is it's not really racial. I mean, like I mean, like you just see we we just went up in the shop and shit. Right. I just I f my, my my people's over there. You know what I'm saying? Like, right. But like, shout out to my boy. Like he he from Hoover, so I ain't really you know he not blood or crib, so I don't really you know what I'm saying. It's not really no gang politics or nothing, but like as far as as far as Wilmington, as far as Wilmington, like we won't get along with no bloods. So it's kind of like it's kind of like I wouldn't say it's racial, but we won't really be fucking with a lot of people. Okay. You know what I'm saying? But at the at the same time, it's it, it's different because like I tell you what, like in the city over Long Beach, yeah. it's like over there, it's like Mexicans versus Blacks versus Asians, you know what I mean? <laughs> yeah. it, it's different, over there it's different, over, <laughs> over here, it's, over here it's, we f with who we f with, you know what I'm saying? Okay. It's really not. Okay. So really there not it's like much. a real racial thing in Long Beach. Yeah, Way hell more yeah. so, really? Hell yeah. Like, I was, <laughs> well, no, I, they got like Islanders too, like Tongans and shit. Bro, that's Samoans. Yeah. They got a lot of little races out there, but it, it, it's just very different because over there it's just, it's just like either you were SA or you were Crip type. Okay. You know what I mean? Okay. Over there it's different. It's kind of so, one yeah, it's just, but over here it's just more like, but like I said, over here it's, it, 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 it get, uh, it get tricky too because, I mean, it's, it's Mexican, it's a lot of Mexicans, but at the end of the day we beef with each other, but you might, you might fuck around and, 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 and run up on somebody that's, that's, 
he might be from the other side, but shit, his uncles or where the fuck, they might be from the hood. Oh, you know what I mean? True. So they ain't be like, a lot of that. oh, you ran up on, yeah, exactly. Right. It's a lot of that, fool. It's a lot of that for sure. Wilmington ain't that big. It, it's, it's not. not Wilmington's not that big. So it's like, shit, people from the hood might have family from the other side. The other side might have family from the hood. That's how it goes, fool. Straight up. That's good. Cool. Okay, there used to be a north side Wilmington too. Oh, really? But they they dead. They they it's they're dead. they're not a hood no more, none of that. But like just I got, got Yeah, they they just thing. I mean they just like the bloods. The bloods got they're they're ran right out, you know what I'm mean? saying? Right. They're died out type shit. So like I got family from the north type shit, but I mean they don't, I don't really I don't really to me, I don't really see it like that, like oh they my family for the north. Nah, that's my fam right there, you know what I'm mean? saying? Exactly you like know? it's crazy like in LA like people set up businesses and da 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 and it's like it's almost like they're your guys' businesses if they're in your neighborhood. Yeah. You feel what I'm saying? Yeah. <laughs> That's crazy. Like you can run your business right here, but this is this is the fuck like fucking gangs run LA type shit. You know what I'm saying? That's so crazy. if you set a business like in the that? neighborhood, that's our business every too time type I, shit. Yeah, every time I come to LA, I'll be seeing that shit. It's still, it always blows my mind. Because the Phoenix is like the Wild West, but out here it's like, no. You know what I'm saying? It's our shit. You can run your business here. Yeah, there's, there's. But we need some incentives. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, that's right? that for sure. We you just need some incentives. You, you could be right here. We're gonna, we're gonna be chill with y'all too. Just make sure when it's that time we, we come knocking, it's ready. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> that place fucking like, wild. <laughs> yesterday I was just driving through the hood and shit and and ganging it. I mean, they they out every day. They that's their little regular state, they regular duty. They just patrolling. Right. But. Shit, yeah, shit, I'm thinking shit gravy. I see gang in it. They always harass me. They always search me. Every time. Do, do their thing, and I get I get busy after that. They leave me alone. Right. So this time, they pull up like, step out the car. Woo, woo, everything. So I'm like, So this fuck? is this is your gang unit yeah. from, for Wilmington. For, for, for Wilmington, Yesterday, exactly, yeah. they pull up on you. Yesterday, they pull up on me. So uh, they arrest me and shit. And they fucking tow my car, everything. Took me to jail, all that shit. Try to ask me some questions. Like, gang units? Cops are a gang, straight up. Right. And, 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 and every hood is against the cops, too, because ain't nobody want to go to jail, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> unless, unless, unless you're trying to be, like, snitching and all that shit, then I don't know. You might as well just be a cop. Right. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But, but, yeah, man, so they they done took me yesterday, locked me up and shit, try to, they, they released me, like, in the middle of the fight and shit. And took fucking, all your money, uh, took your car. Yeah, took my money, took my car, took my phone, try to say investigation some more, but, like, we're not really with that shit for sure, but but yeah, ganging it, they 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 do their little duggy and shit. They try to they try to put you, but if they don't got nothing on you, they gonna let you go straight up. Every time they see me, they already know. Like if, I, if I'm not pulling over, if I'm not pulling over to let them search me, gone gone. You better find me. You better find me, cause on the set, like damn motherfuckers, they not they go harass all day. Shit, they program over here. <laughs> exactly, That's man. True. Well, that's Wilmington in a nutshell, brody, so. Shit. Oh, yeah, yeah man. Hey, hey, shout out Valley Club, you know, coming all the way out from hey, Phoenix, Arizona. They came all the way to, shit, Wilmington, man. One of the last cities in, in L.A. with the A.T., you know what I'm saying? Like I said earlier, so, shit. Man, we just gonna wrap it up right here. Wilmington, we on the block. We on L Street on the 1500 with Babyface. If you want to go tune in with my music, tap in. I'm on all platforms, Mr. Babyface. Or you can follow me on Instagram at 373.finance, you hear me? Free the frog, Grammy Mala, bitch. Valley Club, the cult. Valley Club.